Scorpios, welcome back to the channel. It's the scene tarot, and we're going to get into your read. So if this does resonate for you, go ahead and thumbs up the video here on the YT. But if it doesn't resonate, I will have your playlist linked below in the description box. Now, just know this is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate for everyone. So if you're into a more personal reading and you want to get your own information, your own personal design reading for you, go ahead and hit me up at the scene tarot at gmail.com. Um, we have three different packages, the three question for 25. We also have the 20 minute reading. It was 15, but we changed it to 20 for $55. And then we have the 30 minute reading for, um, 30 minutes okay so if you are interested you know what to do the channel name at gmail.com all right so let's see what we have for Scorpio let's put this mic up a little bit Scorpio Scorpio how are you today <laughs> let's see what the vibe is for Scorpio Let's see energy for Scorpio bonus and look at that energies are already coming through and I didn't even start yet. All right. So you have the, ooh, you have the judgment here. You also have the nine of pentacles in reverse. Well, you have a lot of cards in reverse. Look, every one of them that came out just now is just so many things are occurring. Um, there's a decision that has to be made, Scorpio. This is what I'm seeing here. A lot of you could be dealing with an Aries energy since Aries is coming out very strongly within the within the Emperor being here and also within a judgment. For those of you, you could be dealing with a Leo. I don't know why I put this shirt on. It was kind of chilly, um, at least in my house. And now this like big <laughs> thing is like, like this. Okay. So I'm feeling like... You're dealing with someone that is quite, I feel like, like somebody that's trying to keep control of the situation. This could be a masculine energy, um, but it doesn't have to be. But I feel like it's an older energy. So it's like someone that is definitely trying to keep control over everything. But I feel like what happened within their life is that they kind of lost control. Um... They never had it, you know, when they were growing up or whatever situation they were in. They just never had this, like, confidence within themselves. It's all about confidence here, too. And in reverse, I just feel like this person is dealing with so much inner demons, you know. There's no communication with you and this person, whoever this person is. I'm not seeing any communication. I'm seeing, like, some kind of blockage here when it comes to download, when it comes to information between you and this person. I'm also feeling like with the Nine of Pentacles being here, there's so much loss, so much loss. A lot of you are dealing with losing your independence and losing yourself within this energy and just losing a lot of money too. This could also be a lot of money that's been lost within this energy. Um, within this, you know, this, this union between you and this person. There's a decision, like I said, that needs to be made that haven't been made yet. And I feel like your angels are definitely trying to get that under order because this person, I just feel like this person needs to learn another way, another form of way, you know? Okay, so let's see what we have here. Mm, the sun. Wow, be careful with your energy. You're appearing to be the sun to this person. You're appearing to be the beautiful sun. Look at how vibrant and shiny you are. And I feel like this person is drawn to you. This is what I'm seeing here. Like they're drawn to your amazing energy. And it's like you kind of fuel them. You know, you fuel them. You're like, imagine a battery that is dead and it needs life and it needs energy your energy is so bright and it's like you're fueling this person and they kind of need you 
but they're really you know having damage within your heart because you're all over the place when it comes to your emotions so this energy that is coming up you guys is not someone that is making you feel stable they can't they can't even make themselves feel stable within this energy i'm seeing this i this emperor defeated and i'm feeling like this emperor is not even a follower it's kind of like following everything following the traits following what other people are doing that kind of vibe that is coming into your presence and this is who you're dealing with as a person yeah you made a wrong decision here within this energy this is what i'm seeing here with this vibe it's like you're trying to it's like this situation this transition that is happening i feel like it's a lot of manipulation going on here but with all this energy you're trying it's like the, the universe is forcing you to go into this positive um vibe or trying to find yourself back um because a lot of you are trying to leave this situation. This is what I'm seeing, but you're just not feeling like you're strong enough. You're still holding on to something here. Tell me more. Oh, you look at this person as a star. You look at this person like your other half, like this person could, you and this person could have a foundation, could have a life for each other and build something great. But it's like, let's see, the star, yeah, they lie too much. They keep you in this restrictive mode and then you have to find your way out of it. Um, let's see what's going on with this blockage. It's all about the lie. You feel like you've been unjust with this person in this communication. Like this person just wasn't, you know, truthful in it. You felt like, you know what, you can't deal with this. So there's no communication for some of you. This is what I'm seeing, the energy that is coming up. There's a decision that you need to make, and it keeps coming up with the two of wands and the judgment here in reverse. And the angels are saying that this is going to be good for you, but you need to listen to your intuition. A lot of you are having dreams about this. This is what I'm seeing here. Like you're having dreams about this energy. Like you know, like it's like your time. Like this is time for you. A lot of you are fell into some kind of trap. Like you feel like it's a little bit too late. This is what I'm seeing here. Like you felt like this was a little bit too late. Because the moon is here in Pisces. And you felt like, you know, you were having the dreams. You were having the visions, you know, in the high priestess. But you weren't listening. So your intuition is off twice over, you guys. Let's see what's happening with the sun again. Oh, my God. The sun, the sun, the sun, you guys. I'm seeing that within the sun energy... It's like this person, like I said, you need to be very careful with your energy because what happens is that they come into your life and they really give you that five of um, cups where you make you feel very sad, make you feel unstable, make you feel like you're alone, make you feel stripped of all your power and your worth. Like you don't have any self-worth at this point. And this is like in an energy of feeling like you know that you have to make a decision. But you feel like the, by leaving this person behind, you're making all the wrong decisions. In the Six of Swords, it's like you're in the same energy of walking away. But for some reason, you're kind of like doubting that, that decision as well within the Five of Cups. You know the best thing for you to walk away, but you just can't. I'm seeing like this person that you're after is someone that doesn't even have any confidence in themselves. This is what I'm seeing here, but there's a conflict that needs to be addressed. So you're strong enough. You're strong enough in the sun to actually go through this, to actually talk to this, talk to this person. This is what I'm feeling here. Can you tell me more? Yeah, you want a new beginning. So wow. With someone that is quite incomplicated. Incomplicated, is that a word? Comment down below. But <laughs> complicated. Well, okay, maybe I should just say complicated, okay? This person has a lot of fire, okay? There's a lot of fire here. Someone wants a new beginning here. This is what I'm seeing. They want a new beginning. Um, with this person, I feel like you're on the way of trying to making it work, Scorpio. This is what I'm seeing. Tell me more. Tell me more. It's like you want to make peace with this. You want to make peace with yourself, but there's no... I'm seeing no communication, between you and this person and the communication that i'm seeing now is the knight of swords very cocky person someone is really trying to keep this um wall up and acting like they're fine and acting like nothing is bothering them in this moment this is the kind of vibe that i'm feeling from this person 
someone is being very cocky like they don't need you you need them kind of vibe player like energy instead of being very mature and and talking to you yeah look at that the ace of cups in reverse scorpio you're dealing with a lot you're dealing with a lot within this energy within this person it's like you are ready to give this person everything everything but this person is not ready to give you what you want so what about this tent this nine of pentacles angels tell me about this nine of pentacles three of pentacles in reverse a lot of you if you're not careful you're going to be losing your job this is going to be moving very quickly your position I feel like you're going to be walking away from a lot of responsibility. So when it comes to your job and when it comes to money and because of this energy that's coming in, it's kind of like they're taking a lot of accounts from you. You're missing deadlines. You're missing things that you need to do. You're not following instructions the way they want you to. And I'm seeing like if you're not careful, you're going to be losing everything. Okay, I'm seeing the lovers here. Like you're focused on this this person you're focused so much on this person this person is you you forgot who you are you forgot who you are tell me about this judgment Ooh. so you have to make a decision about an opportunity that's going to make your life very blissed and better and i feel like a lot of you are need to make a decision to walk away and with this energy i'm seeing like you're opening a door to something great i feel like when you do walk away from this situation the way i'm seeing it right now with the eight of cups in in the upright you're definitely going to be opening a door to many things especially friendship for you and this person because i'm seeing whatever conflict you guys had it's actually making it better okay this walking away or this um walking towards um the success this this um this adventure that is going to have you be very uh, it's like a long lasting victory that i'm seeing here but be very careful because you're dealing with someone as the four of pentacles someone that is quite a spender someone that doesn't give you that time and appreciation so we have a lot of different energies here we have leo coming up very strongly for those of you we have pisces we have libra energy aquarius also virgo energy aries energy um aries energy is coming out twice over for those of you we have gemini energy also within the lovers here and this is still in the upright so a lot of you are still together we have ooh um libra again you know as well so let's just see what the other energies that we can get throughout this reading let's see what we can see what's happening here i just want to see the angel messages and then we're going to get into some oracles thank you or some more articles for Scorpio. What is the advice for Scorpio? Let's see here. I'm here and look for the signs. Well, that's what I'm seeing right here. And I see unlikely. So there's a lot of negative thoughts here. I'm seeing like someone is looking for a change or waiting for a change. And I feel like, you know, you've been waiting for a long time. But I'm also feeling like the reason why you're waiting for this long is because you don't have any faith. Like someone here doesn't have any faith. They're really negative and they're expecting positive energy to come towards them with this negative force. And that's not how the universe works. So you need to work on your positivity so that energies can flow i'm also seeing perfect timing on the back of the deck so a lot of sag energy is coming out here as well um divine timing is at play here things doesn't you know happen on your watch it really happens when the universe feels like you're ready for it right so you need to really appreciate and learn how to appreciate the universe and really just know that everything is a process and really trust in the process and people used to tell me that all the time
trust in the process and i'm like oh what does what does that even mean but when you realize it yeah you have to trust in the process you guys there's going to be balance coming back towards you this is what i'm seeing here tell me more scorpio We have acts help from others so a lot of you have people that are very supportive but you just don't know i'm feeling like this energy you're not going to get it from people that you think anytime i look at the card i'm like yeah this is someone totally different someone that you don't even you wouldn't even realize that's going to help you i'm seeing don't stop so don't stop believing don't stop doing what you're doing you're doing the right thing you're on the right track I'm hearing don't give up for those of you who are really in the dark the dark vibes right now and feel like nothing is happening the way you want it to happen and you feel kind of like lost. I'm hearing like hold on. This is what I'm seeing here. Okay, so yes. So you're going to have the happiness. You're going to need to choose. And remember, we went to decision, decision, right? There's a decision that needs to be made. And I feel like that is coming up for you again, Scorpio. So just know that there is a huge decision that you're going to have to make very soon. You have the time now to heal. You have the time for yourself. But at this moment, you have to get yourself prepared for what is about to happen. Okay. All right. So tell me more for Scorpio. The planes. Why are they moving so quickly? One after another. One after another. You see, Atlanta, ha um, Atlanta, uh, airports they're like highways and um there's a plane right behind another plane so it's like they're taking off back to back okay <laughs> all right they wanted the huge they, they wanted this big airport so they just built it okay and they're still build, building more runways it's crazy all right so let's see what we have here for scorpio compromise I'm here in compromise. So a lot of you are taking that route. Okay, so we have, I don't read these cards in reverse because they're oracles to me. All right, so we have rebirth. We have, ooh, page of wands. We have five of wands and we have the 10 of swords. So definitely some healing happening here. I feel like finally, finally, there is this like realization that there is things that need to be done. Um, and I feel like a lot of you are finally in this place, this place, this place as you realize there's so many things that you need to take care of that you never really thought about, like you never really paid attention to because you're trying to like move or run away. I'm, I feel like it's morally move. I'm going to use the word move away from the past or anything that have hurt you. And it's like back to back. I'm picking up an energy back to back that got hurt. And never really took the time to heal. And when I say heal, really process what have happened and why this has happened. And really evaluate the relationship and, and ask yourself, like, what have you learned from it? Um, no one has done that. This is what I'm hearing, like this energy. The energy that I'm picking up, that person has not done that. And so there is this energy of really healing and looking at all of this. And finally, there's like studying everything um figuring out you know what what part you played in it and closing that door finally so there's a lot of healing and taking responsibility and really getting your mental state and your physical state back because it really affected you emotionally mentally spiritually it affected all parts of your being so you're really trying to get that back within the 10 of swords here and really just like knowing that it's there and taking action to fix it so this is about some kind of friction or conflict between you and another person or this could be more than one person i'm seeing like fights um, this could be a family situation i feel like someone here wants to like rebuild and someone here has this idea of how can we just move forward without this bickering and this conflict here it's like they want this this fresh start this rebirth you know it's like they understand like they understand what happened in this situation now they want to move to another level within your life within the energy so i'm also seeing the six of pentacles here i'm seeing the two of well the three of cups so there's some hidden agenda going on here when it comes to this family or this friendship. 
I'm seeing the King of Pentacles, the Queen of Unity. Someone is trying to bring you guys back together. Someone that is a feminine energy. And they're like, stop. We need to stop right now kind of vibe. It's like we're better, stronger. This is what I'm hearing. It's like they want to get together and give this like some kind of balance, you know, bring balance back to the situation. Someone took a lot from this relationship, from this energy. Healing and temperance as well is coming up here. The temperance is coming up again. Divine timing is at play. You know, patience is a virtue. It's up to you, Scorpio. This, this process is up to you, for those of you. Um, let's see. We have exposed here. We also have cut cards here somebody is like it's like i feel like you're trying to make this work or somebody's trying to make this work but in their own it's like they're compromising but it's like they have to have something from this energy as well they have to have something come into them within this energy they can't just compromise and give everything away it has to something has to come out of it for them i'm seeing like this person is about to be exposed like the truth is coming to the surface yeah there's a change here your chakra your eye chakra is very much open for those of you you are seeing things in a whole different light you're seeing things because i feel like this energy what happened is that you have learned from this you know this person have done a lot you have the ace of swords here so there's a new form of understanding that is coming your way there's going to be a shift of energy out of nowhere justice Ooh. it's like you're going to move forward i don't feel like you're going to hold on to this like you're exploring other options and this is like the this change was necessary for you. Um, I'm getting like this transition was necessary. I'm seeing good things coming towards you in the justice. Libra energy again, you guys, is coming out here. So a lot of you are dealing with a Libra, a Saj also. Okay. We have someone that is afraid of you. Afraid. To come towards you this is what i'm seeing here hmm. i don't know what's going on with that energy but somebody has something to tell you or some kind of messages for you and they're afraid tell me more oh lord these cards are so big Let's see what we have. Ooh, a new beginning when it comes to love, though. So watch out for that. I'm seeing the hangman here in reverse. So definitely someone is watching you, but I feel like when it comes to sacrificing for this relationship or for this connection, this person is having like this doubt energy. Like they're waiting for you to take responsibility here, but you're on your way trying to better yourself, trying to heal. This is what I'm seeing here. You have a choice to make and you're trying to make us this as a peaceful transition as possible. I'm seeing the nine of cups here. Okay. You're on the way to be successful in your life. I'm seeing you're moving forward, trying to fulfill these things, even on your own, if this is something that you have to do. You're moving towards love. So there's a new love that's coming into your life. This is the Ace of Cups. Wonderful, wonderful, beautiful card. And I feel like you're moving towards success. You're moving towards success for yourself. And you're trying to get to a point of being mentally there because right now this whatever this energy was it really affected you negatively negatively you guys but i see the hangman over there so it's like you know it's like this person is waiting pisces energy showing up again is waiting for you to come towards them to take responsibility which is crazy 
but this is what I have for you um, if it does resonate you know what to do like this video give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel and I will see you guys in your next read bye guys